Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, my boyfriend Max and I are going to be going to Starbucks and trying the four most popular Let's holiday drinks. get caffeinated. Drinks. Yes, the four most popular holiday drinks. I've actually never had any of these before, have you? Pumpkin spice, baby. You have? Injected in my You've veins. gotten the basic B pumpkin spice latte. P spice, baby. Is it good? Uh, yeah, it's bomb. So, we are going to be getting the peppermint mocha. Yes. Oh. I, okay, I had one of those two days ago. That's got my name on I it. I saw that ranked as the best holiday drink from Starbucks. Yeah, so dank. And the second is the, the PSL, our good old, our good old PSL. Pump size awesome. Yeah. Okay. All right, what's three. three? Toasted white chocolate mocha. Our fifth drink is gonna be the San, our fourth drink is gonna be the Santa Claus Frappuccino, which is a secret menu option, so. We'll see how that goes. Oh, yeah. Yes, we found the promised land. Our dreams are made of. Hi, um, can I do a uh, peppermint mocha and then a uh, tall pumpkin spice latte and then a uh, tall roasted white chocolate? Toasted white chocolate. Toasted white chocolate mocha, sorry. And then I will do a uh, tall Santa Claus frappuccino. Uh, a Santa Claus Frappuccino? Wait, is that a, is that a is, thing is that a we thing? saw it somewhere? We, we saw it online. Oh yeah, as long as you like the recipe, then we can make it. Oh, like, Wait, like we you, have to read you the do recipe? Do you need the recipe from us? Yeah, yeah that we don't have that drink as like a Starbucks drink. That's like a creation from a customer. Oh, got oh. it. Can I, yeah. uh, can, then I think uh, a, a vanilla bean Frappuccino uh, with swirls of strawberry syrup and whipped cream, please? I, I guess, do you have another holiday, a special holiday Starbucks drink you recommend we get as our fourth? We have a toasted white mocha, we have a chestnut curly, we can do the caramel frappuccino. What was the second one you said? Um, the chestnut curly, the caramel brulee, or the toasted white mocha frappuccino. Can we do the first frappuccino you said? I don't know what it's being said, but the... The, the, the caramel brulee? Yes, that one. Anything else? That'll do it. That'll do, donkey, that'll do. I think we oh, had... Oh, do you want this one, babe? Max reached for the glitter mask. N95 mask for a good Starbucks order. Wait, what is going on here? I mean, yeah, the mask is on sideways. How does it <laughs> not go around the ears? It, it, you rotate one. Yep, but you gotta put... Go. No, it doesn't go around the ears, it goes over the head. What is this doing? That, you're supposed to put that down first. No. Nope. No wonder these things are big time. I gotta, also just have this in. one if you want this normal one. Yeah. I think we gave up too soon on trying to get the Santa Claus creation. I don't really care because that drink, while it was called Santa Claus Frappuccino and it was with red and white, was just vanilla bean with strawberry syrup. It's like not that special. Pause. Comment down below if you think I'm either one, an avid coffee drinker and I love it, or two, I don't really drink coffee. Comment down below. Okay, you're back. Um, Max, tell them. Vic does not touch caffeine. No <laughs> coffee for Vic G. I like to say I'm high on my own energy. So oh my strong. gosh, it looks so fun. Yeah, there you go. Awesome, thank you, sir. You're welcome. I appreciate you. Have a great day. I appreciate you. <laughs> I, appreciate I appreciate you. you. I can't believe I've never had a pumpkin spice latte. Sweet, All so, right, first one. Well, I wanna. I almost wanna quiz you. Okay. Because I feel like it's Wait, very clear needs what to the lick flavors that. are. This is the actual epitome of like the best part of the drink is this, this little like Nipple? whipped cream. I mean, one of us should. Yeah, sorry. It's a sprinkle. Mmm. They're like caramel sprinkles. All right, dive into that. That could be big time. Wait, those are like sprinkles that have like little bits of caramel texture. This one first because it's a wrap. What is this, our caramel brulee one? Oh my gosh, I've yeah. already spilled it on myself. I always have napkins in my car because I have like a perpetually runny nose. It's not fun. It should just see how that one compares to the normal caramel frappuccino. Oh, you would know, I wouldn't. So you yeah. can give a good, okay. Is it just the same? I'm gonna say the exact same yeah. as the caramel frappuccino. But they just I haven't it... had a caramel frappuccino in the years, but from what I remember, but they very just, similar. But they just call it the caramel brulee one when it's the holidays. All right, the unidentified one. Well, I feel like I, I need. One. I feel like I need to know when I'm having a pumpkin spice latte for the first time. You will know if you don't know. If you can't figure out what's the difference between pumpkin and peppermint, we have issues. Okay. What if it's really high? I'm scared, I feel like it's gonna be hot. You're gonna be fine. 
drink the co drink the mocha. What if it's hot though? No, I'm kidding. Get out of here. Okay. Instant analysis, go. Good. It tastes like melted peppermint chocolate milk. Just so good. You get the nice creaminess, but then it comes in with creamy. There's no creamy in that. It's yeah. There's. I mean, it's like milk. So it's like mm. creaminess, and you come in with the peppermint. That's just a great December drink. Love that. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We haven't been giving them ratings. Okay, like on a scale of one to ten, give the, give me this one. Seven point nine. Interesting. I'm gonna give it a six point five. All right, you can. Leave the car. <laughs> no. All right. Here's where I'm at. I don't love peppermint, so it's not doing much for me. It's a solid drink. It's better than halfway, but it's a seven means I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I'll okay. Wait, and then the caramel one. What are we rating that? Just like a. I mean, I'll just go a seven. I mean, it's delicious. Yeah. But it's just not. It's too much. I couldn't drink the whole thing without feeling like it's. I don't feel lot. like I'm in the North Pole. Yeah. So I, I need that feeling. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna give it a seven as well. Okay, the next one. Here we go. Okay. This is her. This is your first pumpkin spice latte yeah, ever? Yeah, but I feel like it's like a rite of passage to be like, I've never had a pumpkin spice latte, so you can't call me basic. And I'm losing, I mean, I am basic. Okay, here we go. Got. Oh my gosh, here we go. Long sip. Wow. I mean, big time. This is why I know she's she's got the rep that she does. She deserved it. Wow. How have I never been getting those? That is delicious. That is delicious. Wait, I'm literally addicted. This is. <laughs> That's good. What's your rating? A ten. Damn. Okay, like. So you will never get a better coffee beverage. I give this a ten out of ten for pumpkin spice lattes. Oh wait, I've never even uh, had any other yeah, kind. So. All right, that's that's <laughs> tough to tough to beat that. I give this like an A an A plus. So now we went from the number scale to the old letter <laughs> scale. Wait, I can't believe that. I'm I've going been... eight one. I think it's better than the peppermint. Yeah. I can't believe I've never had this. I'm just thinking of all of the wasted times you've said, babe, I'm going to Starbucks. Yeah. And I'm going go, to Starbucks. Do you want anything? And no. I, I the like, only Starbucks drink I get is a strawberry refresher. And I can't believe all the times I could have said, give me a pumpkin spice latte. Wait, and this comes in different versions, correct? <laughs> I would like this with some whipped cream. Okay, now we just gotta go to the toasted, what is this, toasted white, whatever. Toasted white chocolate mocha. Mmm, this smells like a melted, burnt marshmallow. Mm. We went with a slower sip this time. I don't know, I really didn't get much out of that. Yeah, you were too quick. You gotta slow it up. You much, yeah. This just tastes like a, a normal light latte. You know, like when they eat lots of cream latte. I'm getting wafer vibes out of this. I get that vibe. My like head. those little wait those little cream filled wafers that you was, used to get in elementary school. I know That's what, what it tastes like. I know like. what you're talking about. Mm. I mean, it's definitely not bad. Once it's it's not bad, but it's not in the category of the, the first. The smell three. was better than than the yeah the taste. That's a fragrance you want. Give me the white chocolate mocha fragrance. Wait, I need more of my my girl. And give me pet. Wow, I can't. I'm just still in shock. Like I feel stupid that I never had one before. People love pushing back on Starbucks, but there's a reason. There's a reason that people are bought in. I give the toasted white mocha, um, I give it a seven. It's a solid drink. I'll give it a, a six, four. The frappuccino's so good. I forget, that's like literally candy. I know, I used to drink frappuccinos all the time when I was younger, and now I just like feel sick if I finish one. Do you? Um, I don't know about sick. <laughs> Max is like, no. Yeah, I mean. He's like, um, so I don't know about good. sick, but uh, best ever is how yeah. I feel. <laughs> <laughs> 
Wait, so you were that basic teenager that went after school and got frappuccinos with the cool kids. And then you decided at 18 that I, I'm not gonna go the pumpkin spice train. I used to get the double chocolate chip frappuccino or the strawberries and cream frappuccino, depending on my mood, if I wanted chocolatey or sweet. I don't know, I just never, I didn't like pumpkin or pumpkin spice until very recently. Like I would say two years ago, I started to like pumpkin and pumpkin spice. So that's why, and I'm not a coffee drinker, so I just didn't occur to me to go. I would get, I got hot cocos until I was like 18. And then I was like, ooh. You got hot cocos as yeah. an 18 year old. I'll get hot cocoa and uh, coffee cake. I feel bad that I'm actually making fun of your hot cocoa purchases because guess what I used to get? I mean, what's more kitty than a hot chocolate? What? I used to get a cup of whipped cream. Are you a dog? And <laughs> nothing else. Is that what they give the dogs? Yes. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. Puppuccino, that's what it is. I used to get those. Vic used to get puppuccinos. <laughs> I just used to go and my mom would be like, what do you want? I'd be like, a cup of whipped cream. And then she would get me like a, a cup of whipped cream. I honestly respect it. That's good eating. I used to get the puppuccino. I'm mm -hmm. dead. Okay, well that, ooh, I feel like I have to burp. Oop. Flush it out. Nope. <laughs> and I smelt it a few seconds later. Ew, yeah. That, that was so gross. Hold on the window. <laughs> that was so gross. Um, okay, well that's all for today's video. <laughs> Thank you guys so it's much for watching. Okay. Make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel and give this video a thumbs up if you had a good time. And you can follow both Max and I on Instagram. And you can follow my other social media accounts if you want. Thank you guys so much. I will be back. Is there a lawnmower? Yep. No, it's a Christmas tree cutting thing. The oh. holiday spirit. I was like, why is there a lawnmower? He's cutting Christmas trees down across the way. Oh my god, that is so festive. Okay, thanks again for watching this video. I will see you guys next week. And what else do I say here? Merry Christmas! Or Cheers. happy holidays. Whatever you believe in.